everyone. My name is Clyde Jefferson F. Mandihar. I am a grade 1 Masai student of Mrs. Joan L. L. Carbonell from Iligan City Central School. Today, I am going to talk about parts of a plant. There are many types of plants in the whole wide world, but I am going to give you an example by using the most famous produced in the Philippines, corn. Have you seen a cornfield before? Good, let's get started. The roots. The roots is located below the ground and absorbs water and minerals from the soil and helps the plant stand and stable. The roots are the feet of the plant and that's where the mouth is located. It's like a mouse because it's like a huge vacuum that sips the water from the soil and the roots lead it to the stem. The stem. Stem performs much important work for the whole plant. They support the plant and heal up towards the light. Stem acts like the plant's transportation system. It receives water and minerals from the root and distributes it among other parts including leaves for the root processor with the help of xylem tissue. And the stem transports food in the form of glucose produced from photosynthesis from leaves to other parts such as roots and stems with the help of phloem tissue. So, transportation of fluids between the roots and shoots is done by the stem with the help of its tissue called xylem and phloem. A leaf is usually green, flat, lateral structure attached to a stem. The leaf is known as a plant food factory because it prepares food for the entire plant through the process of photosynthesis. Flower. Flowers are reproductive organ of flowering plants. It makes seeds which become new plants. Let's go to the yummy part, the fruit. A fruit is a part of flowering plant which Protect the seeds by covering it. Some plants and trees are fruit bearing, but corn's fruit is called a crop. A crop is harvested when it's fully developed. A seed. A seed is reproductive part of a plant. It is the part of a plant what we plant in the ground and from which a new plant grows. Corn seeds are very important and useful. They can be cooked such as cheesy corn in a cup, rice, corn soup, and our favorite, popcorn! Thanks for watching, everyone. Bye-bye!